Mayor Jim Fouts in Warren says people here won't be ticketed for hiring a lawn service to do basic maintenance despite Governor Whitmer's executive order. I respectfully disagree with uh, the interpretation that it's not an essential service. Especially, Mayor Fouts says, for people who physically aren't able to care for their own yards, like seniors. We rarely speak with a customer. There is zero risk of me infecting anybody or the customer infecting me in any way. Um, at most, we wave at people from inside their windows. Joe Kelly, who owns a landscaping business in Warren, says unattended lawns could lead to blight and rodent problems in a matter of weeks. We started uh, a week ago and we're out doing cleanups, um, but basic stuff in the last couple days we have shut it down. This morning, the governor's office reiterating that unless the service is necessary to maintain and improve the safety, sanitation and essential operations of a residence, it's not allowed. But we're seeing that interpreted differently. The Roseville Police Department posted this to its Facebook page, telling people they're allowed to have a lawn service cut the grass. Some landscaping companies are still offering the basics. We took it upon ourselves to call the police departments in every municipality we service. We called two law firms and we also called the attorney general's office. And our understanding is that they will not be ticketing companies who are mowing the lawn. We are suspending all mulch installation, flower planting, brick paper patios, retaining walls. In what's usually a busy time for landscapers, many, like Kelly, are hoping the governor considers loosening this particular restriction. And in the last week, I've probably lost five to $8,000 in sales. The governor is set to speak on extending that state home order this afternoon at three o'clock. I'm told she will also provide an update on essential versus non-essential business at that time. In Warren, Jen Schantz, 7 Action News.